When applying sequential visuals, you want to make sure that you have the performers grouped in the order that you want to have the visuals applied in. Currently, our performers are grouped from left to right, so that's going to apply a sequential visual from left to right, following the order of the performer list here, from green to red. I want in my example to have my performers apply the sequential pattern from front to back. So in order to do that, I'm going to regroup my performers. And I'm going to do them in individual lines. So I'm going to group them as such. Okay. And now when I select my performers, I can show you that it is from front to back in the order that I want to have the visual applied. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to create the visual that I want to apply sequentially. I'm going to choose sit and I want them to take four counts to sit down. When I apply this, it's going to apply it to all performers that I have selected. When copying a visual, it will only copy the lead performer. So I'm going to copy. I'm then going to paste the visuals. And I'm going to choose to paste the visual at count one because that is where I applied my visual, as you can see in your visuals editor here. I'm going to sequence every one count, and I'm going to have it sequence in the order that I have. So it should apply it from one, two, three, four, from front to back. I'm going to apply these changes, and I'm going to test the animation. And now I have my performers sitting from front to back. And then I will do the same for my subsequent lines here, ensuring that I select my visual in my clipboard at count one. And now I, I have all of my performers sitting properly.